lots of covers back in the 50s, just a, almost an ungodly amount of covers of artists covering each other's records, particularly white bands covering R&B records with immense success, such as the case with the Diamonds with Love, Love, Love at number 21. That's a cover of the Clovers R&B hit, Love, Love, Love. The Cl Clovers version went to number 4 R&B, and it was like really their first top 40 hit on the pop charts, Love, Love, Love by the Clovers, and then the Diamonds covering uh, the Clovers record. <laughs> it almost sounds confusing. Uh, the Diamonds from Toronto, Canada, they formed back in 1954. They got a break in 1955, or so it seemed. They 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 auditioned for Coral Records in New York City. They put out a record called Black Denim Trousers and Motorcycle Boots, and it bombed. And the reason why it bombed is was because of the original version by Cheers, the group Cheers. They took their version up to number six in 1955 which obliterated the Diamonds version of Black Denim Trousers. The Diamonds, they returned to Canada despondent, but they didn't give up. They went to Cleveland later on. They hooked up with a DJ named Bill Randall. Bill Randall had a reputation of helping groups from Canada. He helped a group from Toronto called the Crew Cuts, helped them get a deal, deal with... Mercury Records, Bill Randall did the same thing with the Diamonds. Got them an addition with Mercury Records. And the interesting thing was, when the Diamonds did their addition with Mercury Records, they did spirituals. But Top Brass and Mercury, they signed them to their rock and roll label. Why do fools fall in love? Just They hit the ground running, went to number 12 on, on the pop charts. 1956, first hit by the Diamonds of Clover, the Frank cover of the Frankie Lyman song, and this encouraged Mercury. When Mercury saw the success of their first single by the Diamonds, a cover of the Frankie Lyman song, they were like, hey, let's get all the R&B songs we can get our hands on it. Let's, let, let's have the Diamonds cover them. Oh, man, they had a run of hits covering uh, R&B hits. The Diamonds did. K Ding Dong, Church Bells May Ring. That was earlier in the countdown. Also, uh, their biggest hit, Little, Di Little Darling, originally done by the Gladiolas, and Love, 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 originally done by the Clovers. Although that one wasn't really big for the, for the Diamonds. That went up to number 29, number 30, I think, on Billboard's Hot 100. It definitely a lost 45 by the Diamonds. The Diamonds, now I don't know if anybody remembers this. You probably have to go back, way back to the 50s to remember this. The Diamonds also did a nice cover of Buddy Holly's Words of Love. That was in 1957. And that was a pretty substantial hit for the Diamonds cover the Buddy Holly record. But here they are at number 21 with Love, Love, Love.